and one of the videos I was particularly liked of yours was the school catchment area videos. Yeah. So, so what are they then? So with the school catchment, we talk about how house prices have uh, changed in a set, set frame or set period of time, but also give information about the schools. So what is, it, what is the offset rating? How many uh, A to C grades do they get GCSEs? Um, in some of our areas, what is the, uh, how many percentage-wise speak English? Because it is quite a diverse community within Leicester. So it's talking about, talking about that, but then by owning a house within, say, half a mile or a mile of the school, how much is your property benefited by having that excellent resource of the school there? So Odeby as an area is, is renowned for highly rated schools, very good, popular, and it's one of the main driving factors for people moving to Odeby. So why not publish an article on that? And it is such a, uh, an important thing for any parent. Well, I, I know your first video, um, the school, someone in the school's uh, Facebook group picked it up within a few hours yeah. and shared it on the Facebook group of the parents of the school, yeah. and it got 3,500 views in a day. Yeah. Because if you think about it, the only people in that Facebook group are the parents who own yeah. the houses in the yeah. school catchment area. Yeah, yeah, and, and that's 3,500 people of our local audience as well. But, but don't you fear what people say about you doing all these videos and, and the derogatory comments? And Yeah, you get derogatory comments, but... Um, again, I think for I think either Tom Panos or Gary V talk about it as well. So, for every hundred likes, you're going to get your derogatory comments. It's it's part and parcel of what comes with it. So but it's, people it's, don't it's, like that. It's it's not a problem. You just got to immunise yourself against it and and not worry about it and, sh and shrug it off. At least you know about it. And sometimes it can be constructive criticism. So one of mine is I like to use my hands a lot on my videos. So I do make more of a conscious effort to try not to, to use my hands, but it is part of, it's part of me. I think the magic thing is, Luke, is, is there's no escaping from the truth. And if you're a bit of a wavy hands sort of person, then, then you're a wavy hands sort yeah. of person. That, just so, be yourself. Yeah. People love that. Yeah, but equally, by them making a comment, that's helping my reach. Because by them commenting, is going to their friends, so their friends see it. And sometimes their friends will then see them as a bit of a prat. But... It's also helping me get further afield. Have as well. you had your leg pulled about your videos then? Um, not really, no. Um, people comment that they see me all the time, um, and but what and what is the 89th Street in Odeby? Um, so uh, a particular <laughs> Will from Newton Fellow Wells in East Leek um, wants well. to know what the 89th Street in in Odeby is. But people are con people are consuming it, and and people do like the content. And that's the magic thing. If you've got the engagement, the attention and the engagement, yeah. you're on a winner, aren't you? Yeah. Is there anything else you want to say about landlord farming? All I'd say is get out there and do it and start doing video and don't worry about what you look like um, and what you sound like. Um, because once you get a few under your belt, they'll be great. And, and just get out there as soon as possible, and, ju and just rec and just record. And if it's and don't worry about ums and ahs and making the odd mistake because that's raw and natural, and people will forgive you for that. It doesn't have to be BBC polished or a film. Well, your first ones were appalling, if you don't mind me They're saying. They're crap. <laughs> They're crap, but and it's but now. it's but it's rabbit in the headlights, and you pick up tweaks and techniques, and they can they can either run it past people in the group, and they'll give. Honest criticism. Share the story that Tom Pallas told you about the chapter one, chapter ten stuff. So again, it's so if you're going to get started in video, don't look at someone that's doing it now and, and compare your chapter one to someone else's chapter ten. Look at the journey that they've gone on in order to get to that chapter ten. I mean, look at all the good ones. Michelle Gallagher. I mean, her first ones where she was stuttering. You can't stop her now. She's on it all the flipping yeah. time. Um, you've got Lorraine at Tamworth. She's, yeah. she's on it all the time. You're on it all the time. She was a bit like a rabbit in the headlights. She was, she? wasn't she? Yeah. And now look at her. Yeah. Whips the camera out and off we go. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. I mean, another one to look at for property videos is Richard Morris in, in Loughborough. Uh, it looks like a model, so it doesn't... He's good-looking lad. Yeah, he is very good-looking lad. Nice teeth, good cheeky smile. But, again, his videos are great. So, again, he just gets in front of the camera and records. There you go. Luke, you've been amazing. Lovely. Thank you. Cheers.